I'm News 10's Britt Lafasso. A new Iberia man is dead after being struck by a truck while riding his bicycle on his way home. According to state police, 39-year-old Lawrence Abair was struck from behind and died a day after he was hit. The driver passed a breathalyzer test and is not facing criminal charges. Good morning, Acadiana. It's News 10's Lainey Miller. The Lafayette Parish Coroner's Office plans to take over sexual assault nurse examinations from a local nonprofit, Hearts of Hope. State police are still investigating what led to the death of Lafayette Police Senior Corporal Cedis Jolivet during a standoff in Generet two weeks ago. Over 30 witnesses have been interviewed so far. Good morning, Acadiana. This is News 10's Dawson D'Amico. The New Iberia Police Department is beginning to set up crime cameras in all districts across the city. Good morning, Acadiana. I'm News 10's Rodrika Taylor, a KLFY exclusive story on how a viral video on social media turned into a police investigation. New Orleans rapper BG spoke to the youth at the Lafayette Detention Center Thursday. The rapper, who was released from prison last year, will perform tonight in the Hub City. We spent our morning today at the Cajun Dome Convention Center getting you ready for Battle of the Torch, an amateur boxing tournament taking place this weekend. Once again, a little cooler, less humid this morning. That makes a big difference for August. By the afternoon, we're pushing back to 99 under mostly sunny skies, but it won't be too muggy outside. So enjoy that.